the easy way to program repeaters into a Baofeng UV5R. First thing you want to do is go to frequency mode. Frequency mode. The repeater we want to program is 147.300. That's where we listen to it on the VFO. So we're going to save this to a memory channel in the radio so we don't have to keep programming it. And we're going to put it on channel 18. To do that, we're going to hit the menu button. We're going to go to menu number 27. We're going to enter that and save it to 18. And it's going to say something. Listen to what she says. So it's receiving memory. So that channel 18 is now, if we go to our channel mode, channel mode. see channel 18 shows 147.3. And when I key down KN40JV, it shows 147.3. There's no offset. I can't talk on the repeater like this because it's still simplex. So we're gonna fix that. And to do that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back into frequency mode. Frequency mode. And the, the frequency that we transmit on is 147.9 because it's a positive 600 or 0.6 offset. So 147.9. One, four, seven, nine, zero, zero. Okay, so that shows there. We want to attach a tone to it because there's a hundred Hertz tone on this one, and that's channel 13. Transmitting, let's put it at 100. There it is, 100. Save it by hitting the menu. Okay, now we want to, now there's a tone attached to this frequency. When we transmit, we'll be transmitting that 100 Hertz tone. So now we want to save this 147.9 to that same 18 channel because this is the transmitting data. Here we go. Menu. Item number 27 once again, menu to enter it. We're going to hit 18. Now listen to what she says. Transmitting memory. Transmitting memory. All right, let's, let's get out of there. So we're, let's go to channel mode. Okay, it shows we're on channel 18 with a 147.3 positive offset. Let's see what happens when I transmit here. Okay, N4OJV testing. Okay, it shows 147.9. When I unkey, it went back to 147.3. All right. There you have it. The quick way to do it on the Baofeng UV5R without having to adjust the shift and the offset. Good day.